Hello everyone on the internet and thanks for tuning in. This is another Toku, another Toku unboxing from me, Ryukiva, from Ryukiva Toku, if I didn't say that already. Uh, so, Toku unboxing. First time I'm doing an SS figure of Masked Rider Amazon. Amazon. I'm not even going to attempt to pronounce the name of this SH figure art range because I've heard so many people pronounce it differently, but I'm going to call them SS. I've got quite a few, I've got three, three SS and I'm going to be getting more in the future but for now this is the very first one that I'm actually opening uh, Amazon so Amazon's price range is actually the cheapest of all the SS figures I believe I got this new I mean the seals are intact the box uh, literally it just says SH figure arts in English everything else is Japanese apart from ages 15 and up warning choking has small parts not for children under three years Products may differ from photo, Bandai Spirits, and yeah, and then like the little small print, Tamashi Nation, designed by Tamashi Nations of Japan, Bandai Spirits 2018, so this was released about a year, last year, uh, bear in mind I'm recording this now in 2019. So, on with the unboxing, there goes the seal one, I'm doing both seals. Uh, because it's like it's a top, you know, like you pull the lid up from the box. So, I have no idea what to expect, but again, this is a shower rider, so I'm not expecting too much detail, though that's exactly what, I mean, you see the inlay is just on the top from the off. Uh, the inlay tells me that it comes with five pairs of hands, two scarves, uh, the belt, uh, yeah, like the little vroom vroom thing is detachable. It, it specifically says the platelets are all detachable apparently, and it says stuff might. Oh, it's it says like the GG bracelet paint might wear off. It says the little antenna on his head is delicate, and then it, and then literally just like the Amazon's uh, riders, like it's got a lot of sharp bits. So it even says warning sharp. I mean, looking at I me mean, now that I've wow, the paint job is the best I've ever been again compared to all the previous SH figure arts. I mean, looking at the chest plate, he's like they've done like a sunburst finish on it. I'm pulling out the plastic from under his boobies. That's a lot, like I'm feeling the sharpness of it already. Uh, right, that's a plastic under it. Ow! <laughs> yeah! They weren't kidding when they said it was sharp. Uh, again, the paint job is insane on this. Even for a shower rider. I mean, again, I was just expecting it to be basic. The paint job on this is insane. Uh, I mean, I, don't, I mean, the video is not going to do this justice. But again, you look at that plate, that chest plate, it's sunburst, it's amazing. The legs are thick, this is a very heavily weighted figure. Again, the Gigi bracelet, or Geek, was it Gigi or Gigi? I can't even remember. It's been, I mean, I only watched Amazon's, it was late last year I watched Amazon. Amazon, yeah, the 1970s version, you know, with that little brat. Who that was he was that the one where the little brat wanted to go toilet or was that super one? I think that's super one actually. Alright. I mean the GG bracelet because I think it was the villain that had the Gargar bracelet if I remember correctly. I mean it says the antenna's delicate, but actually that's quite solid, but I'm not gonna start pressing my thumb down. Eyes, yeah, typical kind of headlight style eyes. And yeah, just as it implied, the mouth is actually movable on this. I don't think there'll be any other rider figures with that. I mean, I didn't mention this before. I should have mentioned this before actually taking the product, you know, un, you know undoing the seal. But, like, I did deliberate buying either the SS or the regular SHF. And, you know, I'm like, I am going to buy as many SS figures as possible, even though I know nothing about it. I mean, the balancing on that, I mean, it doesn't feel too... I don't know, does it? Actually, even just... Even though it feels like it shouldn't be well balanced, it's not... It's pretty decent for the balancing. Let's see what else is in this box. Right, so there's a white variation of the belt. Uh, no, there's like, you've got the... I mean, again, it did say that the fascia comes off. And then there's basically... A fascia where the 
you know, the vroom vroom handlebars, vroom vroom handlebars, where the handlebars aren't attached. Uh, there it goes. Um, right. So yeah, apart from the closed hands that are already there. Oh, he's got claws. Um, right, I'm gonna put the closed. I'm gonna put the facial without the thing on there. That has gone on quite easily. Let's have a go with the hands. Actually, this the you know again when it comes to detachable hands, it's always best when they're a little bit rubbery. And again, I can really feel how sharp this Amazon figure is. So just to quickly finish off, I'll put a claspy hand there. I mean, it's I mean I'm looking at the instructions real quick. Yeah, yeah, it's saying, I mean, I'm just, as I'm looking at the instructions, it's saying, like, certain parts are movable, so, like, on the back, like, even the, f I don't, I'm not entirely sure why they've got that detail, but it's nice that they have that there, well, I guess if someone wants to be re like, they don't want it poking out, so it's flush against the back, because, again, if it's like that, you can see there's a little bit of a gap, I guess they really wanted that attention dealt with. And actually, looking at the sockets uh, on the wrists, they're a lot smaller than your regular SHF. Uh, so I don't know if that's meant to make it easy. Yeah, I can already feel that's made it easier to attach. And I can't. I don't remember him using this as a weapon per se. But I'm going to put it in his hand anyway. There you go. I'll use it like a lollipop because I'm an idiot. Um, yeah, it's, yeah. So I like the using the description jazz hands. So he's got some jazz. He's got two. Se they look. They all look like jazz hands to me, apart from the claspy hands. Um, right. So set of jazz hand. What a jazz hand. God, this figure's sharp. Right, that GG bracelet has come off. I think, yeah, it implies it. I guess in the show you see him, like, with it on, with it off. I think. Anyway. What pose was I going to do with this again? Oh, I'll add a scarf just to finish off. But it is one of the rotatey scarves, which, again, with the previous figures I've hated. Um... Right. Uh, right. Let me just do this to finish off. That's really tight, actually. Ah, and it's there. Right. So let me grab what I dropped. So he's got the bib. He's licking his lolly or ice pole or popsicle, wherever you're from, whatever you call it. He's saying, no, this is mine, even though it's not a popsicle to begin with. That's me mucking about. See you next time.